Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we are going to learn, how to make autocomplete text box, with multiple token field, by using jQuery with Ajax in PHP. In one of our previous tutorial, we have seen how to display image in pre-populated autocomplete text box, by using jQuery user interface library. Then there are some viewers has requested us to make video tutorial on autocomplete text box with multiple token field. So, here we have published this tutorial, this type of feature mainly used when we want to search data with multiple words. Now we have start learning this topic, so this is our testing database, here we have one apps countries table, in this table we have store world, all country. When user has start write in text box, then based on user enter query, that query related country list with populated, below text box, but here user can add multiple country token in text box, for search data with multiple search query. This is our working folder, here store we have make two file like index.php and fetch.php. This is our index.php file, here we have already load jQuery library, bootstrap library, jQuery user interface library and bootstrap token field library. Here we have use bootstrap token field library, for make autocomplete text box, with multiple search field, using Ajax with PHP. Now we have moved to write HTML code, so here we have write input type is equal to text, name, and ID is equal to search data, user can type country name here. After this, here we have write button type is equal to button, ID is equal to search, by click on this button, we can get the value of multiple selected token field value, on web page. Below it, we have write span ID is equal to country name, under this tag, we will display selected country name, from text box. Now we have moved to write jQuery code, so here we have write, dollar with text box id search data with token field method this method will initialize bootstrap token field plugin under method we have write autocomplete option this plugin has used jquery user interface library autocomplete plugin for make autocomplete text box under this option we have write source callback function, with two argument like request, and response. Here in request argument, it will get search query, and in response argument, it will store data, which has been received from Ajax request. Under this function, we have write jQuery.get method, and under this we have write fetch.php, it will send Ajax request to fetch.php. Here we have to define data, which we want send to server, so here we have write query double colon, request.term, it will send query which has been entered by user in text box. After this, we have write success callback function, it will receive data from server, after Ajax request successfully completed. Under this function, we have write data is equal to, json.parse method, 
and under this we have write data argument, it will read JSON string, and return as JavaScript value. After this, we have write response method, and under this we have write data, it will display as search result below text box. Now we have go to fetch.php file, and here we have write dollar data variable is equal to array. After this, we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write is set function with dollar get query variable. If this variable value is set, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar connect variable is equal to nuke to class with mysql host is equal to local host database name set to testing username set to root and password set to blank after making database connection we have write dollar query variable is equal to select country name from apps countries table where country name like dollar get query variable order by country name in ascending order and limit 15 this is our search query for search country name and it will return only 15 records Below this query, we have write dollar statement variable is equal to dollar connect variable with prepare statement with dollar query variable. This method will make query for execution. And for query execution, here we have write dollar statement variable with execute method. After query execution, we have write while loop, and under condition, we have write dollar row variable is equal to dollar statement variable with fetch method. Under this method, we have write to class with fetch association method. This method will convert query execution result in array format. Under this loop, we have write dollar data variable is equal to dollar row country name. It will store all country name under this dollar data variable. Now we want to send data to Ajax request in JSON format. So here we have write echo statement with JSON encode method. Under this we have write dollar data variable, it will convert array into JSON string format. Lastly, we want to display, search text box multiple token value on web page, so we have go to index page. And here we have write, dollar with button ID search, with click event. So when we have click on button, then this block of code will execution. Under this block, we have write dollar with span tag id country name, with text method. Under this method, we have write dollar with text box id search data with value method. This code will fetch value of text box and that value will display under span tag with id country name on web page so here our code is ready now we have check output in browser friends here we can see when page has been load into browser then on web page we can see one text box with button here in text box we have to enter country name, so here we have start write country name, when we have start type, 
then that query related country name list has been display below text box. So here we have selected United States country name from list. After selecting country, it has been display as token in text box. Now we want to add one more country. So here we have start right country name. And after this we have select Australia from country list. After selecting country, Australia has been also convert into token, and add after United States. So here we can select multiple token, from this autocomplete text box. Now we want to display selected country token on web page, so we have click on button, after click on button, it has display selected country name on web page. So, this way we can make auto complete input field, that allows to user to select multiple value, from auto suggestion, by using bootstrap token field plugin with Ajax, PHP, and MySQL database. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box, or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends, or even you can also share on social media also. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.